This is Bram from Admire and in this DSpace 7 Lightning tutorial video I want to talk about the new processes feature. Historically DSpace 6, 5 and older versions have a whole range of server-side maintenance scripts that primarily um, are used for maintenance of the repository um, but also for pro processing of batch jobs. And as a repository administrator who primarily works or maybe only works through the web UI of the repository, it's often frustrated not to have any insight in the execution of these, jo these jobs, in the success or in the failures. And this is exactly something that the new processes feature aims to resolve. To access the feature, log in as an administrator and click processes in the left hand menu. This gives you the overview of all of the known processes that have been executed together with their start times, their finish times and whether they successfully completed or failed. When you click one of these jobs, you get a little bit more information, including the parameters that were used. And it's possible that this page will get even more extended with, with more details towards the future. Let's go ahead and create a new process. In the list of processes, we currently have three, but this list will be extended with other scripts that are relevant for DSpace 7. When you select the script like the index discovery, you will immediately see the documentation for this process on the right side, where you can learn on the different parameters that you can use for this script. And the parameters can be added with this interface. For example, the help parameter, doesn't uh, require any additional information but if you want to use the remove one you need to uh, add the handle as well of the item collection or community you aim to remove it's also safe when it comes to performance because when you click submit on the creation of a new process it will go into a queue towards the back end to ensure that jobs are not executed in a way that they could conflict with each other so this is the new processes feature where we hope that it will improve DSpace when it comes to maintenance, performance and having insight into all of these processes as a repository administrator.